Welcome back to a wonderful another episode of Gaming with Shala. We have Shala at the helm of this episode and Rex Dubois as our wonderful guest. Naturally, I'm Pixel Cheesecake and you'll find the Gaming with Shala videos on the Pixel Cheesecake channel. Yep. Poor Barrett, he's sleeping on the couch. Welcome to, welcome to another episode of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Uh, oh, stick drift. I, I. <laughs> I gotta get a new controller soon. We'll get one in black. Yeah. Sorry, did I wake you? Nope. What's going on? Oh, uh, it's nothing, really. There's just something I need to ask you. So... Can we talk? Sure. Great, but not here. Follow me. See him everyone. Oh, and if you want to sprint, press R1 and then uh, so, L, or the, the left joystick rather, button. Mm -hmm. What? She's in time. Do you think Midgar's over there? Anyway. There's something I need to ask you too. Shoot. That night, five years ago, at the reactor, I saw you lying there. Saw your wound and all the blood. I figured it was too late. Yeah? <sighs> what you do? Wait, what are you implying? That I died? That I'm some kind of imposter? Ooh, heavy. There was some... There's something coming to... On May 30th, I believe uh, I'm having this conversation with you close by you where are. you're you're living that I'd have to drive yeah. up to Marlton Look. for. Oh, uh, a My place score. that would piss that off the ASPCA, huh? After you left, Zonkar hey, found me. He's that the means. one who brought me to the clinic. He the risked his life carrying me out of the chicken. reactor and down the river. It wasn't Chicken just him kitchen. though, there's the doctor who operated on me all night, and the nurses who looked after me for days on end. I'm here now because they were there for me then. And where were you again? In fact, where have you been this whole time? For five years! You know I can't tell you this. Sorry, I'm having an anime headache. <laughs> of course you can't. Honestly, if if so headaches were taken as seriously as anime headaches when in anime, mm -hmm. certain headaches would never exist again. Like, oh, you're hurt. I don't think you could. I think you could make a the best medication for headaches, but I don't think you could eradicate them. You, you so, The cure would be to solve stupidity. Sadly, there's no cure for stupidity. could just pick up where we left off, like nothing had changed. But I guess I was wrong. Guess 
I saw. I was so happy to see you again, but maybe I shouldn't have been. You two fight. No. We have enough problems as it is. Copy? Night. Tomorrow is another day. Do you recognize that voice actor? No. No. You'll hear him again in a hot minute. Okay. <laughs> Keep your secrets. It's the original voice actor for Red 13, if I remember correctly. What's a piece of seven FF7 media? Name absolutely escapes me. A gift from our humble establishment. Though it may not look like much, it should help you to break the ice with those you meet. Queen's blood? Oh. Do you like card games? Pussy. <laughs> no, I will not be playing Triple Triad. No, thank you. <laughs> no, I'll be playing Terraway. Most recent in a series of crises. Multiple <laughs> reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the Sector 7 plate, culminating in this unprecedented destruction. Which making me play Terraway was a part of the good morning, sir. I must apologize for not introducing myself to you earlier. I'm Broden, the owner of this inn. Your companions have all stepped out. Oh, but Barrett left a message he wanted me to pass along to you. You missed roll call, soldier boy. Luckily, you're on leave for the day. Don't waste it, though. Get your equipment checked ASAP. Some <laughs> advice. Hi, my Perhaps name's Broden Boss. dealer is in order? Good idea. By the way, Cloud, do you have any folios on you? Yeah. In that case, you might also want to pay a visit to Magnata Books. They have stores all over, but the first official one was built here in Calm. And their resident scholars are remarkably talented. If you want to unlock the true potential of your folios, you should go see them. The first customization is always free. That's how they hook you. Finally. Rough day yesterday, huh? You've been waiting for me? I've been waiting for a chance to thank you properly. Without your help, I'd still be in Hojo's clutches, trapped in that lab. It was nothing. Even so, I owe you a debt until it's paid. I said like people. I'm going to accompany you. Oh, uh, if you're getting your equipment checked, have them check mine while you're at it. Sure thing. <laughs> the rook's got a backbone. Shifts. It's not me doing it. And why did their small town become Venice? <laughs> yeah. 
geographical limitations prevented them from making it come Italy. That picture is supposed to be pixel? Huh? I'm a vending machine. Oh, I think so. There's like a little girl. I'm gonna be honest with Did you see what the tech demo for the new Unreal Engine built? Ah, finally decided to get up? Uh, no. There was a picture of a car on fire, so and they dragged a shape well, around it. Waiting for you, of course. You have? Got business with the bookstore? If so, I won't keep you. But if you're free afterwards, wanna climb the clock tower together? <laughs> sure. Let's. For real? Awesome! Since it was my idea, I'll go get the tickets. I'll meet you in front of the tower, okay? <laughs> uh. Welcome to Magnata Books. Oh, I take it this is your first visit to one of our stores. Well, customization can seem tricky to the uninitiated. It takes time and experience to get it right. But I think you'll pick it up quick enough. Let's give it a try. Oh, there'd be a fun... I have a fun idea for an RPG. Okay. It's technically a reverse RPG where you're, you're the villain right, building up an army. You have all we the have information the on the heroes much more to this and you nerf, the, nerf their like skill yet, trees. But you'll see. Making them as weak as possible. So when Will they... Go up to fight you. Baby. Yeah. Make it so that, uh, the dungeons play to their weaknesses. Yep. Ooh, spiffy. I personally have an underfang myself. I can I can avoid making that joke, unfortunately. I tried. Yep. I'm voting you, Chief. That's the okay. uh, Morning. Morning. Everyone's kind of off doing their own thing. I noticed. Say, uh, this tank remind you of anything? Yeah. That thing's a tank. I that promise to you. You remember the dress I wore? It was one of my favorites. Uh. The light blue one? With a bit of green in there? Yeah. <laughs> this is such a quiet, peaceful town. Would you say it's, it's a little weird to be too calm? 
This tranquility is what makes it <laughs> This is such a quiet, peaceful town. Drop a comment if you actually likes that joke. Not everyone would, but don't encourage it. Damn, that is yeah, please don't. Come on, Mr. if the you internet know, doesn't you encourage me, who else? But saying who else is going to? Of what he could be you just don't have to have a lot of rocks for that. <laughs> Yay! Oh boy. <laughs> Don't encourage him, Shala. No. Encourage him to have you encourage him. <laughs> so you're just upgrading as much as you can at this point, ain't you? Yes. Cool. See? what I tell you? That girl is singing, and she's got the voice of an angel. Just make sure you take proper care of her, all right? Oh, and while you're here, check out what we got to offer. Revival earrings? Hmm. Yeah. You take care of that weapon now. Something piques your interest. It's the uh, uh, looking upgrade stuff. You go into the set, the essential, essentially the pause menu. Now let you know how to do it. So, honestly, I would love to see Mr. T and Barrett talk, have a conversation with each other. So they would get along well with their goals of doing good. Yep. It's so bright out! Uh, my, oh, like it was today. My. That's why you never go. Cloud, over uh. here. That's why he's so pale. He's a vampire. <laughs> okay. Let's get started then. And please, Bella. You know those League of Legends initial free. Free 100 hours of internet CDs. Yeah. Someone made those into a D&D &D cursed item. It was a box when you opened it. You lose a couple hundred hours of your life. Mm. And you drop seven charisma points. Yeah. Oh god, we just... Midgar's this away. You find yeah. one CD and then... They just keep popping up in random places. It was uh it was apparently for a high level game. Yeah. But funny, isn't it? How small it looks. I just imagine you It is you, far away. You're setting up for the night, you on for your bed roll. So just did something happen? Like twelve CDs people? come flying out. So I would never allow my party to do that because if they do that, they'll figure out how to weaponize the disc. 
Still, I can tell. In a narrow hallway, there are three cobalt guards I in front of you. When I, was I would roll my bedroll. Don't take her for granted. That's right. Roll for like how many CDs coming up. Oh, and here come the popo. <laughs> It's the sound of the police. Woo, woo. That's the sound of the beast. Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? Thirteen was just in a battle stance. No equipment or anything. Whoa! You got y'all. What is it good for? Say it again. <laughs> oh, wow. They're looking for us, aren't they? Gotta be. No. no They're looking they, for your mum. They would never. They're looking for the audacity. Watch. <laughs> Is that Charlie's there in? I was thinking Rachel Lana. <laughs> I was gonna say Gunner down I didn't know this town had lesbians after the end. Don't worry about your friends. I believe that lesbians. Is in league with the lavender. <laughs> Quick, get the holy hand grenade. God bless the holy hand grenade. Follow me. Yay, a reverse escort mission. No, this is just. It's triggered a buster sword to buster store sword. It's tricky. It's tricky, 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 tric
The inn's not much further, but stay on your toes. Safe. Play ball. If you could have one item from no, any video game, which one would you want? The tunnel in the basement will take you outside of town. Leave All of them. They won't catch you. Either a proper keyblade for myself, to the east. or a farm out there. or be what? To help or this thing? The Buster Sword? Also. No. Or the Materna? Uh, this thing. Oh, Materia. Mm. Looks like a cell phone, right? Converts raw materials into more practical items. A Republic antique, but it still works. Order of more the than me. Star Trek replicator has ever been in a video game. <laughs> this is the this is kind of the thing that it would be using. Why are you doing this? Could have just turned us in. Who knows? Maybe this will turn out to be the worst decision I've ever made. He's an action so room employee, I, I think. Mind, you better get going. <laughs> like I'll sh I'll shit talk Walmart. She means we gotta go on the lane. Can't stick the camera. <laughs> yeah. Now street play is playing. <laughs> oh my god. Yep, no, no, you don't. Your second favorite fantasy. Uh, Shala. Oh god. I'm in heaven. She would she would drag Cloud out, out of there by his widow's peak. With my Aaron, my loving Aaron. There's no beginning and there is no end. <laughs> oh, that's why he has the spikes on his hair in his hair. Went for you her pleasure. <laughs> See, Cloud kept stacking his head up my butt. I like booty, booty, booty all the time. Tifa just got done so dirty by Aerith. She went, mine! We were on a date, kind of. I licked him first, but me seems mine. Oh, Aerith, I love you. My love is oh so true. Now give me that ass. Take it to Pound Town. What role would you fill in an RPG? I think I would be the healer character. I would be the the comedy relief pervert. <laughs> what about you? Roll a twenty for confirmation. Like a job for me. Ah, so you you'd be the baker then. <laughs> I I be like, ooh, there's a chest. I'd be that one gay wizard. I'd be like Gandalf. I damage blast cannon. Nice. You. In the wise words of Sir Ian McKellen, bitch, please. Whenever you say qualify something in this game, there's always someone else who will be saying, who will react as if that 
feel as if you're as if that thing has always been gay. Yeah. You gotta hold the triangle button now. Like Such a gay <laughs> mechanic. The sun. Wow. It seems calm out here. Hey, look! It's fried rock. Look at it all. It's so green. I'm sorry. But... <laughs> Yoink! Someone pick up a. Uh... Thirteen. Talk about oh, sweeping the rug from underneath someone's it. foot. <laughs> Even after everything we've done to it, it's still going strong. It may look that way. Oh, look! But in reality, you can see in the background where they had the original slap fight. Still have a lot to learn. What do you want to know? Hmm. For starters, how do we cross these planes? On foot. Come on now, that's easy. The same way you get anywhere. Pick a direction and start walking. Left, your left, your left, right. <sighs> He's like, there's too many goddamn flowers. This is some gas shit. I guess we won't be coming back anytime soon. Guess not. Come on, everybody. Let's ease on down this road. And there it was. The first step on our new journey. You coming? Yeah. Yeah. I don't whether you've brought your... I hope you brought an umbrella. <laughs> Cause I'm coming. Let's get this show on the road. I'm actually surprised 13's wasn't given more meat or anything like. He looks like unnecessarily skinny for his species. Like. Oh, and if you want to do like power attacks, press X and then go to yep. Oh. <laughs> 